All right, now this next step is actually where I screwed up in the last video. Now what you're going to need to do is just get four B pieces. And what you're going to do is actually really easy. Just um, orange it like this so that way the curved part is facing you. And all you're going to do is just drop it in between two... Oh, shoot. Okay, so sorry about that. Um... You're just going to drop it in like that in between two of these pieces. That one was really difficult for me, so I'm going to see if I can demonstrate again. Um, it should not be difficult. If it's difficult, then, uh, like, keep trying. It, it, I don't know why that was so difficult. I guess because my hand is shaking, and I have not done this in a couple of months. So you're just going to set it in there, and this, there we go. That's perfect. And this is what you should have. When you've got them all in. And I'm going to do the rest of these, and we'll be back. And finally, the easiest step of them all. If you look here, you're going to have what should look like this in your cube when you're all done. What you're not going to do is you're going to get the a screw and a cap, uh, these things. And you're going to put this cap directly over this, like so. There we go. See? And make sure it's real nice and snug in there. Take the screw. And I'm going to put the camera down for this. You're going to just set that inside the hole. And all you have to do with the... Uh, well, yeah, all you have to do next is... Maybe even get it started with your fingers and just screw it in. But there is something you should know. Um, you don't want to over-tighten this because... That can be very bad for your cube. Oh gosh, this is the really bad screw. Um, I might have to use a little bit of force for this one. I think this screw hates me so much. Um, just want to put it in there until it's snug. You know, I'm gonna do a different screw because this screw hates me, and I'm just get it in there until it's nice and snug. And um, let's go ahead and put the caps back on. I put mine in my center pile, so hold on. They go on very easy. You can actually lift this out now. You don't need your stand anymore. What a relief. Um, all I have to do is see this square right there? All you have to do is just put this on the square. Um, your center cap's going to have a little tiny square too that you just put over the stud and push and it's snug. And that was really bad, what just happened there. Actually, I'm going to keep it in my stand for this, because my cube actually started turning in a very bad way. And if I, it kept turning, it would it would explode, and then I'd have to start all over. Um, yeah, Alright. There. When you have the caps on, now sh it should be a safe time to take it off. Your cube might still be kind of loose. This is just because it's half of the cube. You just hold together nice and firmly. Now, this is seriously the um, same exact thing as the last, l as the first half. So, I have 70 minutes left to record, so this is going to be kind of fast. But since you already know how to do it, that's okay. I'll even shine some light on this. Now, you're going to take, just go ahead and take the other four edge pieces that did not qualify for the last half. You can actually start with the edges here, so you gotta start with the edges, and then it makes it so much easier on the uh, others. And the nice thing about this uh, next half is that if you did it my way, you don't have to worry about the block. So that's really nice. And the nice thing about starting with the edges is that it actually makes it so much easier on the centers. And all you have to do now is just set the centers in first, and then it'll create that hole again. Or you can just slot the B piece in. The B piece just kind of gets in the way sometimes, so... Just, uh, and then set this in. That time it just dropped in. And just do that for the rest of the pieces. And what this is going to allow you... And this is, and what this is going to do is it's going to be able to... You won't have to worry about the edge pieces, the middle edge pieces all over again. Which is really nice. So I'm going to put this in, and we'll get started on the next layer. Check that out. When you're done with that, you're going to do the exact same thing. Just grab the rest of the A pieces, 
and you're going to also get the rest of the edge pieces and the corner pieces. And what you're going to do is exactly the same thing as before. You're going to put the A piece in. You're going to find the matching color. And again, in this case, it is green and yellow. And the same thing as before, hollow spots facing each other. Sort of put them in around there. Turn that kind of like that. And get the corner piece that goes there. Set this right there. And what you're going to do now is take the A piece, put this here. Oops, put that there. You don't have to put it in kind of at the side because, I mean, that trick I taught you is still going to work here. You're going to take your uh, next um, group that matches this color and you're just going to fit those in there using the trick that I taught you before. Again, put this corner piece here. And um, take the next A piece, which is right here. Uh, you can go there. And then you're going to take the green and white pieces if you're facing that color. If not, take the green and whatever color you're facing. Um, you're going to uh, you're gonna put those in there. And you're going to turn like this. And finally, you're going to put in the left corner. Hello, my friends. Gonna take your A piece and you're just gonna go ahead and set it in. Oops. Oh shoot. Um just gonna go ahead and set that in. And then I'm gonna take the next pieces. The last pieces actually. Believe it or not, you're actually really close. And to get them proper, put the one that goes in on the left. Remember, this hollow spot's going to be on the right. Just put that in there using that trick I taught you. Um, before. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> the cube totally got away from the camera. Um, you're then going to, um, whoops. Put, let me fix this. I recommend you fix this kind of stuff, those kind of mistakes with a knife or something, something long slender. When you're done with that, just put in this corner piece. It's very important that you put that in before you put this in, or else it'll be really hard. Use that trick again, just slot it in there, and you're almost done. For the next step, grab your green center pieces. Oops, that worked well. <laughs> but the camera's all out of focus now, no it isn't. Oh gosh, the light is in my eyes. It fell over too. Um, hold on. Now, in order to get the C pieces, just take the center pieces and just break them off. Well, don't break them off, please. Don't just pop them off. I guess <laughs> if you break them off, your cube is rendered useless. Um, actually, no, it isn't. You'll just have like one black piece. I guess that you can use to see the inside of the cube. Uh, after that, just um, go ahead and drop these in like before, the C pieces, and when you're done with that, you're going to do, well, let's not get too far ahead of ourselves, because this is kind of for review. Um, and last but not least, well, last and, well, equal, I guess. <laughs> Boom. And next, you're going to take your B pieces. Just drop them in as before. And for some reason, again, this one's tricky. Oh, there you go. Uh, yep, that's in. And then this one. And then this one. And then this one. And, um, then we're gonna do this easy stuff again, where you put this in, the cap, push it in, so that way it's in there nice and snugly, and you're gonna take the screw, put it in, go ahead and get it started with your hand, like that, take your screwdriver, um,
screw it, Annie. Remember, this is one that hates me, so you're gonna hear a lot of... Actually, this time it's been quite cooperative. Uh, until now. Just get in there nice and snug, don't over-tighten it. Even give it a test run because your cube is now complete. It's like as far as it wants to go, it isn't going to go any further. I'd have to use like a wrench or something. If I even can. I'm not sure. It's just not working. And then just put the caps back on. The centerpiece is on. And your cube is finally finished. Yay. Check that out.